What's up Dapper Squad, it's your boy Darius, and we are starting a new show. This is going to be replacing 86, Kuroko's Basketball, or Kuroko No Basket. Very, very, very excited to be starting this and to be doing another sports anime. Let me tell you guys that off rip, but before we get into anything, I do want to let you guys know that with the first and last episode of every show, of every season we do of the show, um, the full length, which is normally available exclusively on Patreon, is available for everyone for free. Click that link in the top of the description. Come back here for the review. If you guys do enjoy that, consider checking out that Patreon. Great benefits. Great great everything over there also if you guys want to watch this live with me uncut and full check out the twitch as you guys can see from the twitch chat great community great vibes over here great wholesome moment don't forget to check out the other social medias instagram tiktok twitter all at dapper darius don't forget to subscribe click that bell so you guys always know when i post over here on the dapper channel let's hop right into this kuroko no basket episode one i am kuroko let's do this mmm I wish schools over here took clubs more seriously like they do, you know? They're good. Extracurricular activities gives you social skills, stuff like that, you know? Oh my god. This dude is on the team. You don't need to try out. You don't need... You're up there. Enter high and the Winter Cup. Okay, so they're new, so they're trying to make a name for themselves. <laughs> I'm sure there's going to be a, so many characters. I'm going to try to do my best. <laughs> yeah, he's getting... <laughs> Talk about an introduction. This guy looks bad to the ass. Wearing a ring on the necklace? I'm saying. I like the heavy dark lines they do. In this, uh... In this art style, in this animation so far. Uroko. The legendary, right? The Teiko with the generation of miracles. <laughs> the legendary iconic. That famous group. So we got our Kageyama and our Hinata off rip. You got to. I am Kuroko. Oh, I am way too hype. I'm way too hype. The manager's always cute. Come on. <laughs> they always have the short hair too, you know? I love it. Oh, she's the coach. Ida Rico. Damn, she's our coach? I love her already. Hey, she's got that. Ah, I see, I see. Yeah, that's insane. Okay, that's her ability. Hey, she looks at him. What's his power level? Oh, 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 over 9,000! Literally is. Hey, come on, one of them is actually over 9,000. <laughs> that's insane. This is gonna be fucking such raw talent. This guy is a brolic though. He's like, where's Kuroko? Right? What was his last name? Tetsuya? Kuroko? Where did he come from? This guy's a literal ghost. Right? The Phantom Sixth Member. No bullshit, okay. Mm. His interest has been piqued. I wonder, because he doesn't have a crazy figure or physique any either, right? But he's is he going to have crazy potential too? Oh, we're not going to know. Anime main character. You know how it be. Oh, we are going to know right now. Oh, his numbers were so low. Oh, he's one of those characters. I love it. I love it. He's literally Hinata, and the other one is literally Kageyama. I think this came out first, right, though? So I'm not comparing, you know? It is a good question. How could he be regular on such a well-known famous team with all those stats being low? And then he literally appears out of nowhere like a fucking ghost. If I actually saw him like that, I'd be actually scared. I'd be like, bro, are you, are you good? 
So that's why. Damn. But that's what makes sense, especially because he was in America, why he hasn't heard of the Generation of Miracles, you know? He's looking for some serotonin kick. He wants to get that. I feel him. Nah, he, I love he's he's a I love how they tease him as being the phantom and he's literally like a ghost. What the hell? We're getting this already? I mean Okay. One on one. We're throwing the ones right now. What's up with this fucking song, bro? The rock in this is gonna be Is this what the OST is like in this show? He's buns. He's so bad I could die. He's buns. What's gonna be his kick? What's gonna be his his nen power? I need to know. I like his voice actor too. I like both their voice actors. I'm very intrigued. I can't lie. To a certain point, he is very correct. Like, effort will only get you so far. That's a huge thing right there. I'm glad he has a passion for it. And he disagrees. Talk about some symbolism. I'm a shadow. I love the saying, though. Hard work beats talent when talent forgets to work hard. I've always been a fan of that. And Rock Lee. We're going against the upperclassmen. I see. I see. This should be interesting. Now, Taiga, I'm mad excited to see him. And I'm curious what Kuroko is going to do. I love that shot. Like that fucking like, bird's eye from below the feet. Not a bird's eye, but like a, a fish eye. This kid is insane. <laughs> He's literally just hanging. Bro, That you could literally destroy that, that uh, backboard. Be careful. Bro, I can already tell the OST in the show was gonna be immaculate. Uh oh, they're locking him up. Yeah, that's what happens. See, this is where you can start winning games with like actual strategy and stuff like that. So that's what I really love about basketball. Like, that's what you call. I like that. <laughs> That's an interesting way to, 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 to stop someone. Oh, yep. Okay. Oh, a beautiful pass. Beautiful assist. Hey, wait, what? Wait. Wait. The ball was right. How? He's like, yep, open. I love how you don't, they don't, they body block it every time we see him pass. So we don't actually get to see him pass. But his passes have been immaculate so far. Oh, oh, the one hand twister? We're going to see the first one as well. He's the, who excelled at passing, the Phantom Six Man. That is not what I was expecting our main character's abilities to be. The Generation of Miracles, the Phantom. Those passes are insane. Look at this guy. Wow. We're down one? Is he going to score? Or no, he's shooting though, so he's going to be amazing, right? No. Oh, Kagami out of the blue. Okay. Oh, I can already tell there's going to be some high fast moments between them. There's going to be some there's going to be some dope shit. Oh my god. That man needs to have his caloric intake. Wait, he didn't even know he was there? I thought they were eating lunch together. Oh, man, this kid just shows up out of nowhere. Hey, heck yeah. The start of a... The start of a blooming relationship. I don't like guys you suck, but you earned one of those. You had some nasty passes. Oh, 
Wait, so we're gonna be seeing them? Are we gonna be going against some of our old generation buddies? Ooh. Oh, I'm down. I'm down to watch you guys. Wow. They must be nasty. Ooh. Which is his job to make the focus on the light, you know? I will be the. Now, this is not the the relationship I was expecting them to have at all. The stronger the light, the better the shadow can work at, you know, making it have more of a presence. All right, on to episode two. This one is called I Am Serious. Let's do it. I love animes that have like a same intro every time, you know? Got the daily drills, daily practice. I respect it. I like the color of the paint on this court, to be honest. I'm serious, okay. Got our resolve down pat. We're gonna be the best player in Japan. What do we need to be a full fledged member? Yeah. What are we missing? Ooh, is that a PSP? Oh, an official club. So this is like a test trial. She was doing the same thing. Kuroko came out of nowhere and she spit all over him. Yep. <laughs> I like it. Monday at 8.40 on the roof. Yeah, I'm curious about that as well. I need to know some backstory about that. I need to see them. I need to see them and interact with him. And he's gone. Wow. That man is a actual phantom. Monday, roof, 840. I'm saying... So why are we on the roof when the morning assembly is in five minutes? Whoa, it's gonna be like a drill or a test or something. That's our main goal. Hit, nas hit nationals. I like it. He's like, yeah, I'm down. What, the commitment, the resolve? Oh, wow. Okay. That is quite the punishment. That's why her and her dad were talking about, I hope they do me. I hope, okay, I hope they pick me. Easy. I love you jumped on that bar kind of swaggy as well. He's letting them know. Introduce yourself. Let them know your ambitions. <laughs> Class twos are uh are like they're doing that again. That's that's funny. Hey, guy, we can't hear your whole life story. Jesus Christ, this dude. This dude. There are people like this. I know so much. I I know. <laughs> like shut up. <laughs> Stop saying that, my man. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's your anime main character story. Hell yeah. Does he even yell? Yeah, I'm not good at speaking loudly. I was literally gonna say, does this guy even yell at all? Got the megaphone. Damn. Kuroko didn't get to say his. Damn it. The main character, too. Gotta have the typical scolding from the principal. Makes sense. That is hilarious. <laughs> I didn't know Kuroko didn't even get to do it. And he, bro, every time I think they're going to lunch together, and he just... That's so funny to me. Uh-huh. So, kind of like Shiro Torizawa. 
してる気がしたんです。Interesting. なんだ Interesting. Oh, Lord. 奇跡の世代倒しでもすんのか。あ、君とこのチームを日本一にしたいからです。So he wants that team where he wants to feel a part of that bigger goal. He wants to, he wants to make him the best. We are gonna be the best. I like that already from Kagami. That's some... that he had to announce. He couldn't. He's not good at speaking loud. He had to announce his goals and everything like that. I just, I like that. I like that. I need to do that, man. I wish I was still in school. I'd announce my entire goal. Dapper Darius. Class 1A to be the best reactor there is. You know, I'd be out there. Oh, you, they did the same thing in High Q. You gotta read the magazine. Oh, this is the old school issue. Is not in here at all. Yep. He's the Phantom. Come on. Yeah, I can picture them being like superstar type. Yeah, they're true prodigy. You're like you're a true prodigy as well, but you're like a different type, you know. Oh, see, this is what I was waiting on. A practice game. I'm down. Ooh. Not too many characters have very vibrant hair colors in the show. So if I see vibrant hair, I know it's going to be someone kind of crazy. I, I didn't. The model, huh? Ooh, I kind of like his earring. He seems like a little Chad, kind of douchebag type of character. I mean, I'm not, I'm not assuming. I'm kind of assuming, but. OST already slaps. Ooh! Put the burners on him. Oh, <laughs> the quick turnaround. My man is nice with it. Yeah, that was a quick ass pivot. Especially for how tall he is. I don't know about that. Nah, they're hyping them up because one of them's here. Issei Ryota. Yep, I knew it. Mmm, 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 mmm. Me either. Me either, Kagami. Look at this. He's the Oik. Wait, he's the Oikawa? We already. I mean, Oikawa. We already got the Oikawa? Oh, it's Rapskitties. Hell yeah. He does look kind of dabber. He kind of looks swagoo. Kuro Kochi. An all around or not excelling in any one particular part. They're letting us know that right now. This is how it is. This is the Raditz, you know, Dragon Ball Z. The first of the Saiyans to come, but he's the weakest of them. I'm excited. Ball got thrown, immediate reaction, immediately stops it. Ooh, pretty boy, come on. The music is too damn good. Let's get a little bit of power scaling, see where we stack with some of our current competition. You know I'm always down. Ooh, with the, with the fake? This animation is nice, too. And that was the exact pivot that Kagami just did. You can tell Kagami's quicker than the guy he, who's defending him, but he can. Him, he's like Taskmaster. He can copy like that. He's like got the sharring on, but Kagami would. But he got enough power to push through. Oh, oh, oh. now nah, this show is gonna be sick. I can tell. The animation was flowing too, especially with the hair. Like, ooh. Now he's even more fired up seeing how good they actually are. And there's four more stronger than him. I'm saying. Why is that shit too good? Why are we so hyped after two episodes? Two episodes? Talk about two episodes to start us off. Um, was not expecting that to be the relationship between... I wasn't even expecting Kagami as a character. Like, I... I knew Kuroko was going to be our main character. I see him everywhere. And I knew there was a character named Kuroko because the title of the first episode was I am Kuroko. So, was I, I mean, but was not expecting him to want to be the shadow to bring out the light of Kagami. And for Kagami's goal, like it's such an interesting, unique context and setting for this show that Kuroko used to be on one, like 
the team. Then they all drifted apart, and he's searching for something he didn't have on that team. And he's kind of found it in his goal of making, you know, like that kind of unity be a part of something bigger with Kagami, and I respect that. And we're already throwing a curveball in there with getting uh, Kyota, Risa, Kise, Ryota in here. And oh, we're going to be having, mm, this is going to be insane. I'm excited. We're going against his school as our first practice match, right? So even though we had a little test run with him going against somewhat 1v1 against Kagami, we're still, we got an official practice. I'm excited about that. Excited to see some more of the animation. The OST is absolutely phenomenal so far. I don't know. Um, I need to see more of the side characters. I really enjoy their coach so far. And her dad. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm liking it so far. I, I I get super sports high school vibes, which I don't know if that's just from Haikyuu. I mean, it has to be my only experience watching a sports anime, but I love it. I love it immensely. So with that being said, if you guys did enjoy, leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Check out the Patreon for early access and full length. Check out that Twitch for watching uncut and early full with us. Great community. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace.